Disney Lorcana, for those who don't know, is the official Disney trading card game, allowing you to play with your favorite characters from popular Disney IPs, such as Robin Hood, Beauty and the Beast, The Little Mermaid, Alice in Wonderland, Peter Pan, Lilo and Stitch, Treasure Planet, and many, many others. But even amongst the small army of characters we have in the game, there are still many franchises that this card game does not have access to yet. So, with the release of the first chapter, Rise of Floodborne, and in just a few weeks, into the Inklands, I really look forward to seeing these characters come to the game in possibly set 4, 5, and onward. These are my picks for characters I want to see enter the game. First things first, I guess we'll start with something that has been teased, Wreck-It Ralph. We only got one card for Wreck-It Ralph and it wasn't even a character, it was an action. And that was Pick a Fight. It was a card that was released in the last set, Rise of Floodborne. So it would be really cool to eventually see the Wreck-It Ralph characters come into the game, such as Ralph, of course, Vanellope Von Schweetz, Sergeant Calhoun, Fix-It Felix, Turbo, and even the Cybugs would be cool. And also, I would love to see Lilo and Stitch get more love in the game. And yes, I'm happy with all of the cards of Stitch and the two cards of Lilo and then also Jumba and Gantu that we got, but I would love to see other characters make it into the game as well. Mainly being Nani, they gave us Lilo, two different cards of Lilo, but then they didn't give us Nani, who is Lilo's older sister and also a parental figure. It's like they cheated us. You can't give us Lilo and then not give us uh, her sister. Like, it's so weird. And then the same can be said for the other two characters. You can't give us Jumba Chakiba and then not give us Pleakley. I mean, throughout all of the films and even the cartoon, they're always seen hanging out together. They're best friends. You can't do that. And then again, like I said before, the same can apply to Ruben. They gave us Gantu, and then they can't give us Gantu and not give us Ruben. They are friends. They're, they're co-workers. They're colleagues. You know, they can't do that. So I would love to see cards of Nani, Ruben, and Pleakley. Next up, we go into Uncharted Territory with Gargoyles. I would love to see each of the main Gargoyles get a card. This would include Goliath, Brooklyn, Broadway, Hudson, Bronx, Lexington, and Demona. And of course, if you're doing Gargoyles, you gotta bring Xanatos into the game as well, since Xanatos is their main villain. And if they do do Xanatos, I can definitely see them calling it David Xanatos, Master Manipulator, or Cunning Planner, something along those lines. They also gotta do Alisa Maza, maybe they won't do it right away, but they do have to make Alisa eventually if they are going to do the Gargoyles and Xanatos. And then lastly, something I would love to see come to the game for like Halloween or Christmas or both. I mean, these are very good money-making opportunities, Ravensburg and Disney. But what I would love to see for Nightmare Before Christmas, obviously, Jack, Sally, Oogie Boogie, the Mayor, and Lock, Shock, and Barrel. Anything they add to that is welcome in my books, but you have to do those characters if you're going to do the Disney Nightmare Before Christmas. I mean, they could do anything they want. They're Disney. You know, it, it's none of my place to decide what they're going to put out. These are just my thoughts on what I would like to see in the future for this card game. 
And that pretty much wraps things up. I mean, these are my ideas, my thoughts on what I would like to see character-wise come into the game. Nothing is really confirmed yet, except maybe Wreck-It Ralph. I would love to see those three Stitch characters come into the game, as well as Gargoyles and Nightmare Before Christmas. But hey, I'm sure this game is going to be around for quite a while, so... We can only pray. But with that being said, let me know what you guys think in the comments below and what you would like to see in Disney's Lorcana. With that, do take care, have a great night, and I'll see you in the next video.